The Halloween hodgepodge. For families, it's become a can't-miss event on Egan's park and rec calendar. The Sunday before Halloween, the Egan Community Center becomes swarmed with a whole cast of characters. A lot of princesses and Draculas and uh, a lot of superheroes. All the candy grabbing, rug cutting, and ball tossing is made possible by a different group of superheroes. A group comprised of Egan Park and Rec staff, local businesses, and over 60 volunteers. It's a lot of fun to see the little kids dress up, and a lot of my friends volunteer with me. It's just fun for the community to get together. Sydney Craig is an Egan High School student who loves volunteering at places like Second Harvest and Westcott Library. But volunteering at the Halloween Hodgepodge offers some uniquely fun experiences. We're playing the potty toss. We throw balls into a little man-made toilet. Yep. Another group that stopped by to volunteer was the Egan Women of Note. Part of its exposure, we like to get our name out in the community, and part of it's just we have fun doing this. We have fun being out in the community and interacting with people in Egan. The bustling community center was a bit too noisy for them to sing, so they found a way to incorporate music visually. My dad made those, <laughs> and we were just having fun coming out here and volunteering and having a different way to support the community. Local businesses also did their part. Genesis Credit Union has been the event's main sponsor for the past six years, bringing games and candy for the kids and information about their services to the adults. Well, looking around you, you've got thousands of people here. It's just an awesome event. We're here in the community. We want to give back, make sure that the community knows who we are. We know, we know who they are. I have some candy. Go ahead and pick one of those, or two if you can't decide. 22 other businesses were also passing out candy in exchange for a little exposure. Well, the candy room is always a big hit. I know it's not a, a great thing with dentists, but it's a great hit for the kids. Volunteers are really important to the Halloween hodgepodge. We would we'd be able to run the event without their assistance, um, from the carnival games to the trick-or-treat room uh, to room host and helping decorate and set up the building. And so with their help, we're able to uh, bring this fun evening to all the families. Attendees also gave back by donating a canned food item as part of their admission. Everyone at the ECC did their part to make the community a better place. They were all superheroes in disguise. If you haven't had a chance to come see us at the Halloween Hodgepodge, uh, we do it every year, so make plans to join us next year.